And there you go. Pick the right. All right. Who we got next? The. Oh, yeah. Avengers. Avengers 2. Avengers 2. Now, here's a lot of talk. Who will join the Avengers? Who's going to be the next superhero that kicks some ass? Um, here's how I look at it. You have six Avengers right now. Six. Adding... Actually, you got seven. My bad. Sorry about that. You know, here's the problem I have with this. I would love to see more people join the Avengers. And then and now we have all this stupid talk. Hey, let's let Spider-Man join it. No, no, no. I wouldn't mind Spider-Man being part of the Avengers, but I do not want Andrew Garfield Spider-Man being a part of the Avengers. No. Also, I look at when you... We already... The Avengers already have a huge cast of people. And the more you add on to it, I, it'll be the more it becomes crowded. I mean, there's already... There's only so much in a two hour and 40 minute film, even if... There's only so much you can do. I mean... You can only give some... I mean, it was hard enough, I think, for Wyden to give each character proper screen time. Throw in more characters? The only character that I think can be thrown into the Avengers is Doctor Strange. Personally, I think that's the only character that sh really can be and should be brought into Avengers sequel. Spider-Man? No. Luke Cage? No. Doctor Strange would be a perfect... Either Doc or Hank Prim. Hank Prim would also be a good one, but we need a... We'd, we kind of would need a Ant-Man movie first, but I I go with Hank Pym, Doctor Strange and Hank Pym. I think that's good. Now beyond that, I think that's where it, would, it should stop with this Avengers series because, and it's different in a cartoon having all of the Marvel characters all together. In a movie, there's only so much time. I mean, you kind of it's kind of like with Iron Man three. There's like three villains, supposedly for Iron Man three, and when I read that, I'm like. Uh, three villains. I don't know about that because it's kind of like Spider-Man 3. Why was Spider-Man 3 so bad? Well, uh, other than the stupid dancing scene. The uh, movie was way too crowded. Too many villains, too many people on screen at the same time. Not enough time to give each character its proper dues. And so I think with Avengers 2, I think Doctor Strange would be a perfect... Um, um, addition to the group. Hold up. Um, but other than that, I don't think so. uh, that's about it. Also, actually, you know what? I'm going to make a separate review to talk about the Hunger Game, the small stuff going on with the Hunger Game and, and Philip Seymour, because that's a, like a different thing and that's like a different group of people who like that. But this is more comic book and entertainment. Um, but yeah. It seems like this. these next two years are definitely going to be ruled by comic books and movies. And you know what? This It'll be interesting to see how how much characters are. I mean, we got the next X-Men. Oh, so, oh, yeah. I was going to talk X-Men. Past the past the future stories. How do you feel about that? When I read... When I heard about that, I'm like... I said to myself, this is, could be cool. But the one thing that I really would like to see... Fox, look at me. Give us Sentinels. We want Sentinels. You screwed us over in X-Men 3 and you gave us a Sentinel head. Whoop the freaking do. A head. If you're going to do this, this this story where the X-Men go in the future and they're dead. And it's just, and there's, um, which of course you better introduce Cable. You better, because that's a really crucial character. But give us Sentinels because we all know in the comic book and the cartoon the Sentinels are what hunted the X-Men down and that's why they were dead in that future timeline. Please give us Sentinels. And also Fox, also the Fantastic Four reboot but we don't know much about that right now. We'll see how that turns out whenever it comes along. There's a lot of comic books in uh, Fantastic Four reboot. Let's Just to let you know, the only reason that's getting rebooted is because if Fox doesn't reboot it before 2015, Marvel and Disney gets the rights back. On a side note, Fox was nice enough to give the rights to the of the skulls to Disney and Marvel. So that's so basically now that could they can be used as enemies in the Avengers. So you know what I give I give Fox a hand in that. That was nice of them to hand that over. I mean, we all, they all, I know Disney also has Blade and we got they got Punisher and stuff. But I, that was nice of them. I mean that would be some cool kid. Also Scarlet Witch. Fox also handed them Scarlet Witch to use. Another nice thing right there. Two. Two things that can be possibly used in uh, Marvel Universe and Avengers movies. But, um, 
I think that's really about it in my talk of like comic books and what's going on in the movie world and comic books and how things are possibly be handled. But yeah, what do you guys think? Leave some comments below. I mean, what do you think? Green Lantern reboot? Are you for it or are you not? If it is a reboot, do you want to see Jon Stewart personally? I want to see Jon Stewart as the Green Lantern because as the Green Lantern character, not... Of, let me rephrase this. For you people who might not be familiar with the Jon Stewart character, I'm not talking about Jon Stewart from The Daily Show. Jon Stewart, the Green Lantern, I'm talking about. But would you like to see him as the Green Lantern? And all I see, I would, because Hal Jordan, they tried that. Not saying Hal Jordan doesn't work, but if you're going to reboot it, you got to do something new. You can't just copy the same thing you did before. So I think Jon Stewart would be good. Wonder Woman, what do you think? Green Lantern guy writing Wonder Woman. How do you think that's going to turn out? Who do you think would be the best Wonder Woman? Personally, they had Monica Bremen as um, Wonder Woman or originally when Josh Ryan was touched. She's gone. I thought she would have been a great choice. I honestly, you know, the cat character, I don't honestly know who could play. Who could play. I mean, it's really a toss-up, but who do you think? Um, Justice League. D yay or nay, do you want to see Justice League? Do you not? Do you think Warner Brothers is copying Marvel? Or do you think they're trying, they really want to try to do their own thing and branch out their characters? Superman, are you looking forward to next year's Superman? Personally, I am. Hoping that there's a trailer, a teaser with it with the Dark Knight. Spider-Man. Actually, I didn't really talk about that. But like I said before, I'm not looking forward to the new Spider-Man at all. I'm going to see it because I'm seeing it for free. And I'll and I'll give a, I'll give a thought on it. But like I said, I'm really not interested much in this re, in this franchise. It's not it's not the character Spider Man. It's just the story doesn't sound interesting. Um. But yeah, leave some comments below. Tell me what you think. Um. I'll have an also you people who've been saying you um what's my email and stuff so you can email me. I'm right now. I'm in the process of creating. I'm going to be creating a brand new email that's just attached to this and I, to this account. So uh, um, if you want to ask, collaborate with me and what you think of movies and stuff and comic books and what's going on in the entertainment world, you can use that. Also, probably I might create a I, mean, I might create a Twitter account for this. I, I don't know about that. And I'm also considering changing my YouTube page for this because it kind of my tag for this kind of doesn't somewhat fit what I'm doing with this. But yeah, what do you think? Do you think um? Oh, I was gonna say. Oh, do you think what do you come? Uh, put some. What do you guys think of these uh, movies? Yay or nay? Like I said, leave some comments below. Tell me what you think about this. What you don't? I'll have another video. I'll uh, have another video. Actually, I'm gonna be making another video because that's gonna be on my Hunger Games thoughts. But yeah, and I'll see you guys then in the next video.